All right, questions five and six. So number five asks, uh, a bank offers a home improvement loan with simple interest at an annual rate of 12%. JT borrows $14,000 over a period of three years. How much will he pay back altogether? Okay. Well, if you're borrowing with simple interest, all that means is, is that every year you have to pay back 12% of what you borrow. It doesn't compound, it's only off of what you borrowed. So all together, he's gonna pay 12% of $14,000, but he's gonna pay it three times because it's gonna be per year, right? So I'm looking at this simple interest doesn't mean, simple interest is just, you You only multiply interest one time. Okay? Annual is yearly, and here's your 12%. So for three years, so this is what I'm gonna do, $14,000 is what I borrow. I'm gonna have to pay back that $14,000. But I also have to pay back 12% of it. So I multiply this by 12%. Okay, this is what I'm gonna get. Well, these zeros just kind of go in the brain. I'm gonna get 14 times 12. Right? So two times four is eight. Two times one is two. One times four is one, uh, four. One times one is one, right? So I'm gonna have, now I just gotta put a number, the right number of zeros in here. Um, this decimal cancels out two of those zeros, so I'm left with one zero here, okay? So this is the interest rate I pay, this is the interest I pay on my loan per year, okay? But I have to pay this interest three times because it's three years. So if I do this times three, I'm gonna get eight times three is 24, six times three plus two is 20, and three times one plus two is five. Okay, so my total, um, the total amount I'm going to pay in addition to what I borrowed is $5,040. Okay, and that is 12% interest of $14,000 paid three times. Okay, now I don't just pay the $5,000. I also have to pay back what I borrowed in the first place. So I have to add that to 14,000. And that's gonna give me uh, $19,040, which is choice C. Okay. Number six. Here we're back in familiar territory. What is the volume of a triangular prism that is 75 centimeter long? Okay, that's the length. And that has a base with an area of 30 square centimeters. So I'm going to look up volume of... Um, a volume of a pyramid, right? Yes, pyramid. No, prism. Volume equals area based on time. Okay. Okay. Well, it's all given to me. I don't have a volume, but I am given the area of the base, which is a triangle. It tells me that the area of the base is 30. I am given the height, 75. So if I just multiply those together, I'll get the answer. So let's do uh, 75 times 30. Okay, we do zero, and then three times five is 15. Three times seven plus one is 200. So it's like 2,250 cubic centimeters. Okay, just to remind you with number five, I forgot to, to, to mention, um, this is on your star reference sheet. Simple interest, it tells you exactly how to do it. Your interest is your principal, that's how much money you start out with, times your rate, times your time. So for us, it would have been um, 14,000. Actually, I shouldn't be right on here, it's right over here. Okay, that's 14,000 times your rate, which is 0.12, times your time, which is three years. Okay, which is what we did. 14,000 times 0.12 times 3. Okay. Perfect. Uh, oh, that was, that was, that gave me the interest. I have to add that to the original. See what you get paid back. Okay. Perfect.